Here's Hugh. Still Jermaine Hugh. Broken up and Jermaine Hugh. Also gives it back. So a card will come out because it seems like Hugh got touched in the in the stomach. And the card goes to Horace Sharp. Jermaine Hugh is back up, but he was right in front of the referee. So not a great start at all. First yellow card of the game going to number 27 from Arlen Gardens. There he got the, the left arm. Right in the in the stomach there, and Mr. Stennett was very, very close. And why? I didn't do anything, ref. Happens every time. Beautiful pass. It's at all, Jim McLeish, the former the noon technical goalkeeper, former national goalkeeper. From Aguana to Jermaine Hugh. Gets it to Scarlett. It's horrible, no goals. Scarlett don't want to see the ghetto youth them strive. <laughs> well done by Jeremy Hugh, pushed off by Ticker. And here's Strickland. Could we have the, the first goal of the game here? Strickland. Yes, we do. Gets the first goal of the game. A ball played through. He out sprinted. I think it was Harvey. And early in the second half, it's Arnett 1, Harborview 0. Long ball. Both defenders beaten by one ball. Harvey didn't want to foul him. And Strickland puts it in. Poor defending by Harborview. Both defenders almost square. Strickland got there first. See how hard of you will respond. German Hugh wants to do it, but doesn't. Oh, there is Taylor sneaking up at the back post. Header. And that's Ronnie Amaguana. Jermaine Hugh with a, another opportunity to give his team a lead here. Almost. Almost Donald Stewart. Very good free kick from Jermaine Hugh. Stewart out, jump, out jumps them. And just over. Jermaine Hugh. Gil gives the ball away and here comes Jermaine Hugh. More involved since the, since the goal and now he gets a free kick. And in front of the goalkeeper, Richard Clark trying to, to block him from, from moving. And a card will come out now, but you know, to be fair, Clark was trying to block him from, from moving. Now look at Clark. He's still blocking him from moving. I'm not certain. Referee needs to attack, but you leave spaces at the back and you're vulnerable to a counter-attack ball played through the flag is down taylor can't get a shot off amendment to the rule which means that if you're in an offside position and the ball comes at you and you even allow it to roll through the legs and you don't touch it then they're not going to call as long as they don't think you're interfering with the goalkeeper fagan makes a good turn all oh, good stuff from fagan Oh, scary coming across the goal. Fagan missed the header there, but anything could have happened. Blackburn loses possession. Palmer gives it away, but gets it back. And now Stevens needs to get a good cross here. I don't think you have a... Oh, it's a good chance here for... Oh, they tie the game. That's Fabian Taylor. I was just about to say, I don't think Harborview, they have enough guys inside the box, enough players. They didn't need any more. They had about three in the box. That was a very, very good finish. Stevens with a good cross here. Again, it's poor defending. Now, look at the, the, the Arnett defenders. 
Taylor is all by himself. Stevens had a look up. He knew what he was doing with the ball. It's a good cross. Very good finish. Now, McLeese would have been going across. No, but look at the Arnett defense here, and look where Taylor is. They're inside the box, but no one close to Taylor. Look at that. One, two, three, four players inside the box, none marking. Oh, here he comes again. Jermaine Hugh. You can't give people so much room inside your box. And uh, Max Shaw lose, gives up goal number six, and he would be very, very disappointed with that one. Now, a draw here. Puts it through. Can Jermaine Hugh get there first? He does get there first. Oh, good block. No one following through. Luckily for Arnett Gardens. Last chance here for Harborview. Didn't look offside from here.